All right, hello everybody. Welcome to another video from AA Sports Cards. We try to make these videos in one take, obviously no rehearsal, no script. So we have one shot at this and I'm gonna to try to make it as good as I can. We are here today and as most of you know, the crux of our business today is mostly selling for people on consignment, but we still do buy collections outright. And that's what we're doing here today. And the reason that I wanted to show this video is because we strive to make these videos and everything we do in our business real. No, uh, you know, no, nothing make believe, nothing fake, nothing contrived. And this collection is a very good example of this. And I hope everybody can see the condition of these cards. In today's market, it's so much about condition, so much about PSA 7s and 8s. But really, this is what most vintage collections really look like. These are real childhood cards that were enjoyed in the early 50s and played with, and they are in low grade. I'm not going to spend too much time on this. There is uh, generally the collection is 1952 to 1955 tops. But what I really want to do is I'm going to close this up. And the reason we're making the video today, A, we're very proud that we're buying this collection. And we're going to talk about these cards in a minute. But I hope the camera can get in here. This card, there is some, there's tape, obviously at the top and bottom, and there's some paper loss on the card, some actual paper loss missing. And when we turn it over, there's tape on the back. We've paid $31,000 for this collection. And you can look at that two ways. You can sit back on, on YouTube and scoff and say, oh, those guys are this, or those guys are that. But truth be told, I bet you everybody watching this that thinks that wouldn't pay this much for the collection. They try to get it for far less. We've actually paid a very fair price when you think of the risk involved in selling cards in this condition. Back to the mantle. So I'm. it's amazing to me that there's a lot of people in the world that have a lot of money and want a PSA 7 or 8 example of this card. When you're talking about a PSA 1, you're really limiting the market as to who is going to buy this card. So the risk really is, it reminds me of a, of a hockey team where all of your money is tied up in one card, maybe two. This is Connor McDavid. This is Leon Dreisaitl. And both cards have issues. So this is going to be a PSA 1, we hope. And the amount of people that can afford to buy this card these days at a collector condition is risky, scary a little bit. So when we're spending that kind of money and so much of it is centered in one card, I think you have to understand and appreciate the risk we take when we buy collections. Here are some more of the key cards. Again, the second year mantle, the 53 tops mantle has tape. There's the Robinson. You're not gonna see, I don't wanna take them out of the holders, but every card has creasing. Here's an interesting one. Again, I don't know if we'll be able to see it, but the maze has a significant crease and I believe a pinhole. Thankfully, the cards are clean on the back. A lot of kids in the 50s taped or glued their cards into a scrapbook because there was no other means to display them. But again, when you're talking about buying a vintage collection in low grade, which these cards are, and you're spending a significant amount of money, there's always some risk involved. So as excited as we are today, there's the Jackie Robinson. You can see tape on the back, the front and the back. It's miscut as well. Miscut. As excited as we are, and listen, when you're holding this card in your hand, as you can see in my voice, it it is amazing that I can be, you know, in someone's uh, home. We're on the road today, by the way holding this card in my hand. We purchased it, we own it, but there, you know, it's also a little bit scary. So, still excited, a little nervous, uh, kind of like, uh, you know, uh, but real life. This is a real video, real vintage cards, 
And uh, that's what we strive to do here. We strive to make real videos about our business. You will see this card. You will see this card. You will see these cards and everything else in this collection on eBay under our user ID, AA Sports Cards Vahuda. Very soon, a lot of these have to go get graded. So it's off to California for these. We'll see them soon. Keep watching our auctions on eBay. Keep watching our YouTube videos. Thank you to everybody. You know, it's a, it's a great day, but a, but a, a nervous one too. Thanks for watching. We're, we're excited about this collection and we'll be back soon with more videos. Thanks for watching everybody.